All right, guys, welcome back to the Max Out Show. Today, we're going to discuss how to build momentum, how to make progress, how to start taking the right action steps that you need to take in order to achieve your dreams. Now, this can be important for a variety of reasons. Maybe, you know, throughout this whole COVID-19 thing, maybe you've sort of lost your way, you've gotten off the path, you've, you know, you had some habits before, you had some routines before in your life, and now you're sort of off track there. Now you're just sort of whacking out, right? Maybe it's in your, your fitness routines, right? Maybe you haven't been to a gym in two months and, and now you're trying to get back there. Maybe you haven't been running as much, eating quite as well. Maybe it's your, your working, you know, your, your professional career, right? Maybe you, you know, you've been doing home office for two months and now you really need to get back in this productive and motivated and inspired mindset, whatever it is for you that when maybe you've sort of lost your way or maybe you haven't even lost your way. Maybe you just set a new goal, a new direction, a new dream in your life, and you want to start building momentum there. You want to start making some progress there. Understanding motivation, understanding how to build momentum, this, this sense of forward movement in your life is absolutely critical. And so if you really want to understand what builds momentum, we want to look at brain chemistry. So what happens is, when you know people understand this right it's like when you achieve a big dream a big goal right you you do that thing that you wanted to do for so long maybe it's run a marathon maybe it's get that promotion at work whatever dopamine is released in the brain dopamine is this motivational neurotransmitter that just makes you feel more excited right it wants you makes you want to keep going right so people understand that the thing is released when, when we get this stuff, right? Maybe if it's even, you know, when you click on that Instagram feed and you get those likes, right? It gets this, it gives you this good feeling of like, yeah, I want more of that, right? But what also happens and what is not often talked about, dopamine is not only released when we achieve that big end goal, but it's actually released anytime that we make some amount of progress towards our dream. And this is really critical to understand. It's not the thing that, you know, happens once in a while when you achieve that big dream. Dopamine is actually released anytime that you move forward, that you make progress towards your dream, towards that goal that you have in your mind. And so this is important for building momentum because momentum is nothing more than adding a small, small few, you know, step after step after step sort of momentum type things, one after the other. It's really about taking these super small steps one, two, three, A, B, C, and just trying to build some kind of momentum, trying to release dopamine in the brain. Because once your brain realizes you're actually moving towards your goals, once it realizes, hey, this guy's actually, he's actually getting there. Like he's still far away maybe from that end goal, right? If you want to run that marathon, you know, maybe you're just running three minutes at a time right now, but you're getting better. And this sense of forward movement of progress, you know, progress principle as Teresa Emmebaugh from Harvard University calls it, this is actually what engages and excites people more than almost anything else. The sense that you're actually moving forward towards your goals. It doesn't need to be big steps. It can be super small, but you need to move forward. And so the simple step, guys, the simplest step you can take for getting more motivated and more inspired in your life is simply asking yourself, what's the first tiny step I can take here? What is that one little decision that's going to set me on the right path? It doesn't have to be huge. It doesn't have to be gigantic. It just needs to be a tiny little decision that will put you in the right trajectory. It will release dopamine in your brain. You'll feel good. You start to feel more motivated again. And out of that feeling will emerge new action steps, guys. So that's it for today. The question really is, what's one tiny little action step that you can take today in order to move your life to the next level? Thanks for watching, guys, and see you tomorrow.